In crypto, the loudest projects often get the most attention, the hype, the influencers, the quick flips, and the overnight pumps. But every so often, something rare appears quietly in the background, something that doesn't need hype, something built on solid fundamentals, and that something is Casper. Now, Casper isn't trying to be the next Bitcoin. It's trying to finish what Bitcoin started. Casper is proof of work, just like Bitcoin, but instead of one block every 10 minutes, Casper processes one block every single second. And that's not layer two, that's not some off-chain trick, that's layer one real-time speed secured by proof of work. And the way it does that is where things get really interesting. Casper uses something called Ghost DAG, a block DAG protocol. Now, in simple terms, it allows blocks to coexist in parallel without causing chaos. It doesn't punish you for being fast. It rewards decentralization. More miners, more security, more speed, and none of the trade-offs that you'd expect. No pre-mine, no venture capital, no centralized control. This isn't a Silicon Valley experiment. This is open source, community first, built for the people, by the people. Now, Casper is built on purity of vision, a fast, secure, decentralized network with zero compromises. And that clarity has attracted one of the most organic grassroots communities in the crypto space. Now, this is a network that miners believe in, a token that developers are building around and a project that regular people can still get in on without needing a VC hookup or insider access. Now, the energy behind Casper isn't just digital, it's personal. From solo miners keeping the chain alive in the early days to developers working for free just to move the mission forward. Now, there's a quiet integrity to the whole thing. It's not loud, it's not flashy, but it is real. Now, Casper has become a beacon for people tired of broken promises in crypto. People who want real tech, real decentralization, and a real chance to participate. And if you're already holding Casper, then you probably already know that. You didn't fall for a meme, you saw something that the rest of the world is only just starting to wake up to, myself included. Now you saw a project with transparent development, a growing ecosystem, real mining that's still accessible, wallets getting cleaner, faster, better, and an incredibly loyal, passionate community. You guys back something that's building every single day, not chasing a trend it's creating a foundation. And for you guys who are just hearing about Casper right now, again, myself included, then welcome aboard because this isn't about hype. It's about having the curiosity to look beyond the surface. Ask yourself, why isn't this project mooned yet? And then ask, why is it still here? It's still growing and it's still quietly getting built. And the answer to both of the questions is the same because Casper isn't here for the noise. It's here for the long term. It's here for the builders, the miners, and the holders. For the people who understand that fast isn't just about transactions. Fast is how you outpace the crowd. It's how you get there before the rest of the world even knows that the race has started. Now, it's not too late to get involved. You can still mine it. You can still buy it. You can still be really early. And when you do your research, you'll see that this isn't just another coin trying to be the next big thing. It's a technology that fixes the very thing that crypto was supposed to fix in the first place. Scale without sacrifice. Now, Casper doesn't have a billionaire mascot or an army of influencers who are all pushing it here on YouTube. What it does have is a time-tested code, real community belief, and a roadmap that actually gets delivered. This is a project that's still miles under the radar, still undervalued, still building block by block and second by second. So let's talk some numbers when it comes to Casper. So as of April 2025, Casper's trading at around about nine to 10 cents at the moment. Just let that sink in, a coin with sub second block times, proof of work security, no pre-mine, no VCs, and an organic global community, and it's still trading at around about nine or 10 cents. That puts its market cap well below dozens of coins with zero real-world utility, coins with no working products, coins that exist solely to ride a trend. But Casper's different. It's not just another speculative play. It's a functioning network that solves the scalability trilemma on-chain in real time. And if you're wondering where this could go next, then here's what the data and 
the people are currently saying about Casper. So Casper's future valuation is a hot topic among many analysts and the retail community. Conservative estimates project Casper trading between 8 cents and 39 cents in 2025, averaging around about 22 cents. More moderate outlooks suggest a 2025 range of 22 cents to 27 cents, potentially reaching $1.46 to $1.72 by 2030. And bullish projections from community voices go even further, saying Casper could reach $2 to $3.50 by late 2025, especially if smart contracts roll out and major exchanges step in. Long-term vision, some enthusiasts see Casper at $5 to $25 by the end of the decade if adoption scales and fundamentals hold strong. Still, the story here isn't just numbers, it's about belief, it's about technology that works today and not some theoretical promise that you might see in, I don't know, five years from now. It's about a community that's committed, a dev team that delivers and a network that runs without needing hype to survive. Now, you don't see many projects like that, especially not in 2025, in a market where coins rise and fall on influencer tweets or meme momentum. Casper just stands apart. It's not here to ride the wave. It's here to be the infrastructure beneath it, a real-time high-throughput network that scales naturally, rewards honesty, and doesn't sacrifice decentralization to achieve any of it. And maybe that's why people are quietly accumulating. Maybe that's why the devs keep building and maybe that's why those who know well they just know because sometimes the loudest projects fade the quiet ones they build and casper is building and if you're here now then you're super early